Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Brain Blitz Audios. Flying cars have always been a dream that humanity has worked on. There have been a lot of attempts on it over the years. Today, let's look at a new entry into the race: the Zapata Jet Racer Flying Car. The Jet Racer Flying Car was unveiled in August 2022. By former jet ski world champion Frankie Zapata, whose more recent fame involved crossing the 2019, crossing in 2019 the English Channel on his homemade hoverboard craft, the Frenchman's eponymous company has produced a range of other micro jet-powered aerial vehicles that operate over water or ground surfaces. Including the newly revealed Jet Racer, Zapata had also announced recently that its new Jet Racer flying car will be available to the public. Zapata's Jet Racer differs from other craft in the broad, possibly misnomer flying car category. Unlike Jetson One or Air One electric vertical takeoff and landing personal aircraft. For example, the Jet Racer has no visible propellers and is powered by kerosene rather than batteries. It uses jet engine technology and miniaturized it for creating a strong power source. As such, its accent is more on strong sensations than sustainability. Its main characteristics are maximum speed and maneuverability. However, it has a very short range. It flies using ten micro jet engines to reach altitudes of three thousand meters and attain lip prying maximum speeds of two hundred and fifty kilometers per hour. It can also carry up to two hundred kilograms of weight. Those are far beyond the capacities of other personal EV tow. Under development as commute or medium-range vehicles, trial footage of Zapata at the controls of the flying car also indicate that the Jet Racer is capable of far tighter and trickier aerial maneuvers than other category craft. Craft itself is built atop a light and modular chassis, allowing it to meet multiple needs. In other words, it can be used by commercial, civil, military, and other purposes, and can also be remotely controlled. All of its critical systems are designed in a way to provide an extremely high level of redundancy and safety. 
These include the propulsion systems, power systems, and control systems. For example, the aircraft can still fly even with two failed engines. It also has a redundant electrical control for each motor. Riders can also make use of the steering assistance provided on the aircraft. It's also worth to note that no special qualifications will be needed for these flying cars apart from that of a pilot. In civilian life, the jet racer can be used for aerial demonstrations and leisure activities. However, its quick and agile movements is gonna help the military. It can be used in rapid special operations, and it's also capable of reconnaissance and surveillance flights. This VTOL can also be used as a quick access pathway for boats. The Zapata Jet Racer has several strengths to it. It can access steep landscapes and can fly in strong and turbulent winds. Its electrical controls allow for autonomous flying capabilities. It can be adapted to be used for transportation of specific materials. It's also quite handy that there are no visible propellers to worry about as it uses jet engine technology. That's all for today's video, folks. We hope you found this interesting. For more of our useful and interesting content, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Brain Blitz Audios. We are gearing up to produce new and interesting content, so please hit that bell icon below the video to keep yourselves updated on our new releases. Until the next episode, take care, stay safe, ta-ta for now.